Hello Puppet fans, and welcome to this lecture. In this section we will learn the code versus data approach, and how to separate data from the code. What is data and what is code? To quickly summarize, a component module is a general purpose module designed to model the configuration of a piece of technology, for example, Apache, Tomcat or NTPD. And a profile is an organization-specific puppet module that describes an organization's implementation of a piece of technology. Or a site-specific data to refer to an organization's own particular data. For example, an Apache profile that an organization creates for itself might use the official Puppet Apache module to install and configure Apache. But the profile might also contain resources for an organization's SSL certificates or credentials, layered on top of the configuration provided by the Puppet Apache module. The resources modeling the SSL certificates are necessary only for that particular organization which is why they don't show up in the official Puppet Apache module. The official Puppet Apache module itself represents the code, or the generic and reusable aspect of the configuration, as any good component module would. The profile contains the organizational, or site-specific, data that is fed to the component module, or code, when that module is used. This separation helped to create more reusable codes. As a simple example, consider NTP. A puppet class to configure NTP should make sure an NTP.conference file exists, and that it specifies a server. The logic of what to do is create a file, set the right server. What the right server is will vary from organization to organization, environment to environment and is what we call data so in this example server entry with data and code can't be reusable from organization to organization as each organization will have different NTP servers. So at code to make reusable code by separating the server entry as variable in code without data example. Hire a separate data from code, making it possible to use the same generic code over and over again. 80% of the puppet code most organizations use tends to be generic, only the data varies. So in this example different organization will have different SSL certificates and to make them use same puppet forge Apache module Hira can help them to achieve it. With Hira, you can externalize your system's configuration data. Puppet uses Hira to do two things. Store the configuration data in key value pairs. And look up what data a particular module needs for a given node during catalog compilation. This is done via automatic parameter lookup for classes included in the catalog. And explicit lookup calls. Okay, so in this section we have learned the code versus data approach and how Puppet and Hiera can help to separate the data from the code. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have time feel free to move on to next lecture.